Hey guys, I got some stuff for you today, but I have to keep my voice down. Don't want people to hear this kind of stuff. This is a video response to Anna Scanlon's latest video called Addressing Rumors. And she also did a video yesterday. And this is all about how she is suing the vegan cheetah for slander. Now I want to point out that it's interesting that I woke up this morning really motivated to do the video I had planned to do. <laughs> a video I planned for months here. And then I get this notification. You know, I, I was thinking about it all night. I couldn't even sleep. I was watching that drama stuff too late at night. It's not good for you. So I was planning to do a big video all about the carburetor diet. And instead I'm doing this. But that video, I, hopefully I'll be able to get that video up by tomorrow. So I want to keep this short. But I also want to do a video response to her video from yesterday. Okay, this all started yesterday. She made a video called Addressing Rumors and Frequently Asked Questions, plus information about freedom of speech. And now here's a clip of her talking about what she did after she uploaded. As I said, I don't normally watch his broadcasts. I usually have people go back and tell me that he had said something about me, and I'll go back and capture the moment. Yesterday, I actually did watch his broadcast because I posted a video, and I kind of wanted to see if he would respond to it and how quickly he would respond to it. He responded to it in a matter of minutes, really. Well, that's not a surprise. That's uh, his technique for keeping up with the drama. You gotta be quick, like, like I'm doing right here. And it seems like he does that day and night, He's just on social media. He also has people that he gets information from. And people also say this about Anna, that she's, she's there right away. It's like she's always there. And sure enough, um, she responds to my posts real quick. But what's the big deal with that? It just means oh, none of us have jobs. Of course we don't. Now I personally don't stay up late at night watching Vegan Cheetah's live drama on You Now. So I was surprised to hear California coming up in the rumors. Vegan Cheetah claimed that Anna lives lived in Orange County. I'm not wealthy. My family is not from Orange County. I my fam my parents have never lived in Orange County. Even if I did live in Orange County, it doesn't mean that I w that I'm wealthy because there are a lot of places in Orange County that aren't. Now I can add something here. Because I happen to grow up in Orange County, and I can verify that Anne is correct, that there's a lot of places that are not rich there. A lot of it's like middle of the road, upscale places, and there's also some bad places. I always think of the city of Santa Ana. Yeah, I had this joke going back in the late 90s that no one goes to Santa Ana on purpose. I just would find myself there for various reasons. Is people saying that I'm like bitter and stuff like that. Well, yeah, I am pretty bitter because this is still going on. Um, I'm bitter that I still get people harassing me. I'm bitter that he said this in the first place. I'm bitter that he won't apologize. Actually, I was watching one of his old You Now videos and it looked like he was, he said he felt sorry for if a certain storyline is true here. And maybe he would apologize under certain conditions. Yeah, that makes me think of what I want to cover in my next video about this. I got some interesting footage there for you. See, I have a whole different take on things than most people, which is why I make videos in the first place. And I'm bitter that he keeps bringing me up. Like, it's ridiculous. Um, the other thing is he said that I claim that I have cancer and fibromyalgia and all these, like, tons of diseases. I do not. Um, I have lupus and IC, and so I don't understand why I all of a sudden have every disease under the sun. Oh yeah, that's another thing about his channel. You gotta realize that a lot of his fans come from Tana Mojo. People are like that on the internet. When they've decided that they're against you because someone they like is against you, then they will attack you for any reason. Do you have a gun? Does he have a knife? Do I run? Do I scream? <laughs> I still get people harassing me. I'm bitter because this is still going on. It's but still going on because she's making it go on. Not only did she decide to follow through with a lawsuit where she could just walk away, but now she's all over. But now she's all over social media, you know, talking with people, even watching his videos. And again, you got to see the footage I have. That'll be my next video. Although she says she's got documentation now, it's still strange. And I covered this in my other videos. I'll put the link to those in the description below. Post a comment. Let, let me know what you now think. You now? You now? <laughs> that was just a coincidence I said that. I was thinking, let me know what you think now. Now that it's been like a month or so. 
have you changed your mind about it? Just let me know what you think about this lawsuit, if it's real or not. And just all of the weird nuances going on here. Like, it's really weird that she makes a video after a month and then watches to see if he responds and then makes a video about his response the next day. So she isn't working? Why is she doing this? Oh, I heard a rumor that... Wait. Anna, I heard a rumor that Charlie thinks you're cute. I'm currently investigating that, so I may have something for you on the next video. Bring me your Facebook. Be on the Google Plus. Whoa, the more I listen to her here, it's like totally she's from California. They said that I was slut shaming Alina and like hating on Alina. And I mean, it's just like continuous. They just like don't stop. He had tried to make as excuses. Can't hide the valley girl.